Hello and welcome to this year's FLL season. So this year we've noticed that there's a lot of red and green lines. When trying to run a regular black uh, follow the line program on green it worked fine but when we tried it on red it didn't work at all. So we decided to come up with a slightly modified version to help with this. If you don't understand how this works click the screen right now and you will go to our different video about how this program here works. The reason why we had to change this is because the reflected light intensity number for red was a lot different than for black. Because black used to be around 10, 15, but red is around 70, 80, and white's around 90. So right there it went really, really slow. So at first we thought we'd multiply it, but then we noticed it started like swerving backwards and it wasn't proper. So then we noticed that we had to divide. So we played around with this number until we came up with a number that was available. 1.5 was the one that seemed to work. If this doesn't seem to work, feel free to modify this, but this is what we found that worked. So then this, we're on a red number three. Three right there just means the port, and that goes into reflected light intensity, as you can see. So that right here goes all the way over there. Red 3 gets divided by 1.5, so it gets back to the around the number that black used to be. So therefore, it's fixing the program, changing it back to what it was before. And as you can see, this is kind of a added thing. Right here, this is a loop interrupt, so you don't want it to fall forever. That will never help you in the actual field. So right here, we're doing it where as soon as the other sensor, sensor we have it hooked up to 1, when that senses black, which goes into the white block, goes into loop interrupt. Now, as you can see, all these loops are 43. Even this is 43, the loop that it's surrounded in. So this is all canceled as soon as black 1 senses black. Then it'll stop, and then you can move on to the next. So you put the thing before there and after there, and then you can move on throughout your program. Thanks for watching the video on how to follow the red line.